there folks, look at what has arrived not 15 minutes ago. The Amazon lady brought it to my door. Let's crack straight in, shall we? Oh blimey, it's exciting people, it's exciting. I shall do my best with the microphone once again. It's just here. <laughs> I'll try not to get overexcited and have my mouth away from it too much. Come on, baby. What the shit? Play like never before. Ooh, check it out. Let's get rid of this big... Actually, that box will probably do for shipping the PS4 Pro. Although I might have a slightly smaller one, to be fair. There's the beast, people. There she is. All angles. Now, I'm pretty sure from seeing other unboxings that we're just going to get the controller and system in this one. Don't think there's anything like a little earbud or anything like that. We'll find out. Ooh. Let's pop that over there for a sec. We're in camera, people. There we go. <clears throat> right, so all the little cable bits and controller at the top here. Can we see? Can we see? So we've got the, well, let's get the boring bit done first. You've got the power figure of eight power cord. We've got the sexy controller, which I've already got one of, so it's not a surprise because we unboxed that the other night. I really, I really like the controller though. Very nice indeed. Much more stable. Much more, yeah. I mean, just so robust. Everything about this just screams much better quality than the DualShock. Can't wait to get this DualSense stuff going. USB-C, of course. There you go. I shall keep my packaging this time. I don't have my PS4 Pro packaging. What's in this beer? What do we have? Just manuals, I think. Can't quite get into them. I think it's just lying on the top, actually. Yeah. PS5 user guides, which I'm sure none of us will ever read. Oh, what's underneath? Aha! So in this section here, we have our stand. Because it can't sit on its side by itself without being wobbly. And if you want it to be at its most secure standing upright, then you need to stand it on the stand so you would stand it on the stand like that if it's uh if you're going vertical if you're going horizontal uh it'll lie across the way i'll try and show it in a sec if i can and the little screw for it i believe is in here this spins round yeah there it is there's a little screw for screwing it in if you're doing it, if you're going vertical And our 2.1 HDMI cable. Again, unlike the Sony one, I'm not sure it actually says on it. The Sony one actually, the sorry, the Microsoft one actually says the Series X one actually says on it 2.1. But they have they have confirmed that it is a 2.1 HDMI cable. Super duper fast. And that's it, I think. Oh no, here we go. 
Yes, well, this is important because my dual charger hasn't arrived yet, so I'm going to need this USB charger for the controller, which is USB C. Right, I think it's time for the big reveal, people. Let's get this out of the way. Here we go. Right, what's the best way of getting this out? Reaching underneath seems to be the answer to that one. I say... It's not as um, it's not as extremely heavy as some people have been making it out to be. I mean, there is some weight to it, obviously, but here we go. Oh, that was quite nice, actually. There was no sellotape to deal with; it was just wrapped around it. <sighs> what the shit? Well, it's a bit sexy. Here you are, guys. The rear. And the front. So... The stand, apparently... If you're going horizontal like I am, it literally just, you just sit it on. There's no clip or anything, it just goes on there, latches itself on and just, and then you just lie it flat. And that's it. So you need to be careful if you're doing dustings and stuff like that, uh, because it's not, it's not fixed. It can, you can put it tight, but it's not fixed. And that just holds it flat if you're going for the horizontal like I am. If you're going vertical, then you just go on that way to that way. No, you had it right the first time, Stephen. So there's just obviously the screw that you need to put in as well. But you would go on that way for the vertical. And there you go, people. Just to show you that again, if you're going horizontal, you would just slide it on the back there. It does, it, I mean, it fixes itself tightly enough. Uh, so it won't slide off or anything sitting it like that but there you go there you are people <laughs> what the shit that's me proper new gend up now people proper new gend up so i'm just waiting now for i've probably got about another hour before my playstation 4 pro finishes doing its initialization because i'm just clearing everything off of it so that i can sell it on should have done it last night really <laughs> i didn't realize it was going to take two hours to do it but in the meantime, I'll uh, I'll start prepping up to put everything in place and I shall ch start charging my controller so that I can use this bad boy once I plug it in. And then I'll start some Demon Souls recording for you guys and that'll be up as soon as I can get it up. And there you go. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you in this unboxing of the PlayStation 5. And I shall see you soon, folks. Take it easy. Bye.